<sighs> Alrighty, guys. Welcome back to the wonderful world. Well, yeah, yeah, wonderful world. Welcome back to the world of Little Nightmares 2. This game is uh, a little bit scary. I would almost go as far as to say that there's some little nightmares here along the way as well. I played this game for about six hours yesterday. Um, I think I am pretty close to the ending, but I didn't really want to rush it out yesterday. So we'll find out what ends up going down here near the ending of the game. Now, I know some of you may have not been able to tune in yesterday. You may be wondering what is the story of this game so far. We don't really know. <laughs> we just... It, it's kind of confusing. It seems that the world is very dark and that things are kind of messed up, but we can't really tell exactly what or why or... or I don't know. It's confusing. The only thing that we know is that we met this other girl or boy along the way and uh, we can hold hands just like that I have a, a button on my controller to hold hands basically now at the beginning of the game the um, the friend that we found along the way didn't have that the yellow raincoat and with the yellow raincoat of course it becomes the protagonist from the very first little nightmares how many hats do I have right now excellent question I must have missed a bunch <laughs> yeah I must have missed quite a couple Anyways, this is six. The one with the yellow raincoat. I don't really know what my name is. But, um... We'll find out, I suppose. I mean... We'll find out what happens at the very least. <sighs> this is, by the way, a puzzle horror game. Yeah, I called him Timmy, but... I don't think Timmy was the right, uh... The right name. Yeah, the game has been a lot of fun. I've been playing pretty slowly. But, um... That's fine, right? These kind of games feel much so... Uh, are very much so like a... Uh, like an experience. No particular reason to rush through it. I wonder how far we are from the ending, though. I, I'm curious if I literally just, like... Ended the stream yesterday with, like, five minutes left to play. Uh, the game came out two days ago, so it just came out, like, very recently. Okay, you yeet me up there, Six. Thank you. It may just be, though, that there's, like, an entire, like, extra segment. So we've been to the school, we've been to the hospital. There may just be an entire extra area, you know? Really? You trusting your strength again, Six? Alright, let's go. Faith! Okay, good. No, no multiplayer in this game. Where do you want to go, Six? I thought up the ladder, but... Okay, okay, yeah, yeah. That is where we go. No, I don't think there's any replayability really in a game like this either, so... Did I miss anything, Vicky? Uh, I just started today, Splurge. So no, you did certainly not. Hey, thank you very much. Welcome back. Yeah, she's strong, man. Six, more like six pack. Exactly. She does not mess around. So we don't even really know what we're running away from, though. Like, we started close to this house in the forest, and now we're here, but... We don't really know exactly what it is we are trying to even achieve. Do we just go through... Are, you are we not gonna go in there? Oh yeah, we are. Okay, I was gonna say. Lovely, guys. A new place. What do you think is gonna be next? As far as the location goes. I can hide in here. Why would there possibly be like a little cubby for us to hide in? Seems completely unnecessary. What's the point? This is fine. Do you think I can just um, drink coffee here and chill? The answer is no. 
I wasn't sure if it was just the background that was... Okay, yeah, no, the answer was no. I have some coffee I've yet to finish, game. I think I'm supposed to be running here. Later, Six! Can you... Oh, okay. We just push in the door? Okay, that's how doors work, yes. Oh, God. Jump! Oh. Was that intended, or did I miss? I might have an addiction. It was intended, guys. Yo, it's got a ballistical. <gasps> did six just get wrecked? Come here. Hello. Grab his hand. There we go. Are we okay? Yeah, almost half of six disappeared. Almost goes, was gonna have to call her three instead, but looks like we're okay. Three quarters of six. Oh, okay. Nah, no, we're fine, Chet. Never do math on stream, not even once. Six divided by two? Oof. What is it with these creepy ducks? I don't like the ducks at all. There's also these eyes of Sauron that we see everywhere. You see that eye over there in the background? Oh, a toy factory would be an excellent location for a creepy place, yeah. Oh, no. So this is one thing that we have seen a bunch so far. There's these television sets. And my character seems to get sucked into the TV. But every single time so far, Six has pulled me out. So I don't really know what happens. It seems that we get sucked into the TV, then we like run towards like a door in the background of a corner. But every time before we can reach the door, we get pulled back out. This is what I mean. We do this a couple times. And then all of a sudden we are in the, the inside of the television. I don't really understand. So here we are again, right. So there's a door at the end of this corridor. And so far, we haven't been able to reach the door yet. Everything goes in slow motion here. But I don't really know what what this is even supposed to be. And once again, it's that eye on the door as well. So I think this is the main story, but I don't really know. Can I reach it this time? I sure can. Is it Slender Man all along?
Oh god. Is he gonna come out of the television? Okay. So we gotta run, huh? There's a movie called The Ring. I haven't heard of a movie called... Or I haven't watched a movie called The Ring, but... Oh, jeez. This is very creepy, yeah. Oh, no. Oh no, don't pick up six. <gasps> so we've come across these things as well. These, like, static things that seem to indicate, like, that there were people there once upon a time. It's like a shadow, yeah. So, there's the man actually on the wall as well. I don't remember that picture being there, but I was talking about the eye. Pretty sure the picture of the man was already there. Either that or she's just a big fan of men with hats. To be fair, that is a fashion thing that I think should come back. It was there before. Yeah, either that man was cold, multiply by six, or zero, rotter, or minus six. That makes sense. So wait, do we... This is a... Okay. That seems like a bad idea. Look, six saved my life. I saved her life. I say we're even now, okay? Why do I have to go save her again? I say, guys, just... <clears throat> no, no, I'm just kidding. It's a joke, guys. Yeah, the eye. Sauron is everywhere, man. Can you not jump up there? Oh, you can't. There must have been a reason why we weren't supposed to go there, huh? What's going on, by the way, King Jaceman? How are you? Mr. Peter. Another television? Oh god. Is that his outfit? Why do you care so much about her? I don't know, man. You're very involved into the video game, Peter. That's good. Is this... Okay. This is how we teleport. So I go to the other side, then I take the door back inside, and then teleport with the... Oh, you gotta stay there? Okay, good. I was gonna say, if it's gonna be on a timer, that would kinda suck. These doors really don't have very good hinges now, do they? This is basically portal now. Yeah, we have a portal gun. Well, we need to find that one still, but we know how the portals work. Hey, thank you, photos. Gifting a community sub to Logic. Thank you. Appreciate the generosity. Thanks. What's going on, Torillis? Am I playing a scary game? Yeah, I'm not really good at horror games, but... So far, I've been pretending to be a man. 
this whole time, okay? <clears throat> I've just made awfully expressive faces. I actually, um... Let me see if I can find it. Hartnepper sent me a picture yesterday. Apparently he made a, um, a, a beautiful... A beautiful montage. A collection, so to say. <clears throat> of me playing this game. I don't realize that I have, like, such an expressive face. I don't really, like... Look, I'm a man too. I only had to switch diapers twice. Nice. Some good clickbait material. You clearly can't put an ugly face of yourself on a video thumbnail, guys. Come on now, everyone knows this. Hey! Thank you, small kittens. Or kitten, rather. For the $15 donation. And the uh, words. Appreciate it. Oh, they have AC here, guys. This place is not so bad. Look at that. Yeah, I had a jump scare yesterday in real life. When my girlfriend walked in. Don't tell her, but she's terrifying. Thank you, small kitten. Hey, there's not a portal. She's ice skating, actually. She sent me a picture. Hold up. Oh, yeah. So she's ice skating, apparently. I don't know if you can see that. Apparently, she heard it crack under her feet, so she got very scared. Only to find out that apparently it was her skates, not the actual ice. <laughs> Very clever. No, I didn't ask yet if she wanted to be my Valentine, guys. I know it's Valentine's tomorrow. Should I do this? Because I was thinking it could be her, but I mean, that's been the same for like, you know, it's been like six years or whatever. I could also ask that lady with the really long neck at the beginning of this game. I don't think that's a bad idea. Wait, uh, do I actually have a portal gun? Is that a remote control? Bro, I have a portal gun. <laughs> Alright. Wait. Bro, I've gotten to the point, though, where I don't really know what to buy her anymore for a lot of these things. Like, for those of you that have been... Like, I know some of you have been married or whatever for, like, 20 years. What in the world do you even do for gifts? Like... I don't know, bro. Can I turn off the television? Get it out of here. Maybe I should leave it on. You give her a firm handshake? <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for existing. And that will be that. Flowers and chocolate? Ugh. Buy a bouquet of roses worth 100 euro? Ugh. Give an experience? Yeah, but you can't really, like, go anywhere right now either, man. We're still in lockdown. No, I did- I did get some- I did get some things, but, like... Gives a handshake. Yeah, a firm handshake. A PS5? I'll give her a PS5. Not that she really plays any games, but I'm sure she'll appreciate it. Also, what? Does not even exist. I don't believe it. I could cook for her? I cook for her all the time already, bro. That's the problem. So you're saying I should stop cooking regularly. And then I can actually... Oh, that's clever. Then I can, like, play that card whenever, like, it's a birthday or, like, a holiday or whatever. Oh, smart. I sh yeah, okay, clever. Take her out to dinner? Can't even do that right now either, man. All the, all the restaurants are closed. <laughs> you 
Uber Eats. We actually do have Uber Eats here, I believe, but... We have something even better called thuisbezorg.nl <laughs> You guys don't know thuisbezorg.nl? I think it's called, uh, what's it called in other countries? Um, I've seen advertisements of the same thing over in Germany. But I'm forgetting the... What do you guys have in Germany? What do you call it in Germany? Like the, the home delivery thing, where you like order food from a bunch of different restaurants and then they like deliver it. And it's like one, it's like one collective... No. Bro, I've seen this. Lieferando! Lieferando! Yeah, that's what it's called in Germany, I believe. Lieferando. In Dutch it's called thuisbezorgd. Which is like, like a similar... It just sounds uglier, I guess. Like Dutch is just an ugly language, but yeah. Loco, I got the perfect thing. Give her a gift sub to your stream. Ooh. That's clever. I could give her a tier 3 sub. For like half a year. Not too much, obviously. After that, you know, I'll make sure it automatically renews on her card. I mean, I'm not made on the money. Um, alright. <clears throat> good suggestions, chat. Thank you. Have a good one, Reels Deal. Take care. Do we have a dance break, or...? I don't know, I turned on the television. I don't know... I don't know if there was any reason to do that, but... Am I supposed to turn that TV on as well, you think? Can I reach that from here? It was, it was bleeping earlier. There's a hat? Wait, where? God, these, these commercials are scary. Oh, this is a hat. Oh, I can become like a... I, I can become, what is this? I thought it was, like, a, a policeman, but... I don't know what this is. This is what, like, policemen used to have in the Netherlands. Back in the old days. A.K.A. the 90s. <laughs> Maybe it's, like, a, a mailman kind of thing, though. Yeah, I have the symbol of the eye right now on my, on my dude. I don't think this was even the way forward, guys. I'm pretty sure this was just, like, a little sneaky route. Just for the hat. Look at my country, policemen still wear it. Oh, nice. Come on. Oh, there's another television playing somewhere close by. Where am I supposed to go? Can I go anywhere here? I don't actually know. I think I'm supposed to turn it on and then go back. I should probably activate the other television as well. Oh, can I? Oh, wait, we can hear the other television on the other end. Can I? I think we can probably go to the other television and like... Because this is the most obvious location to go to. I guess the second half of the tunnel, like the, ha the the tunnel at the end of the previous one was fake. But this one probably is here. What's your favorite song, Loco? Clearly this one. Best song of all time. Favorite song of all time. Ooh, that's tricky, man. Can I... Can I control that television from here? No, I don't think so. 
Did I do something wrong? Because previously when I walked in this exact area, I believe I heard like a little flicker to like make sure that I could turn on that TV in the background. Maybe I'm supposed to like leave that one on. Yeah. Do we make a mosh pit? Yeah, that's too much for me, bro. I do appreciate some metal from time to time. Wait, could I just swing across all this time? Wait, did I? No, no, no. I was here already. Wait, 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 wait. Never mind. Wait, what? I, I should leave that one on, I think. No, no. I can turn this one on. Okay. I don't know why I would want to do this, though. I think I might be able to do something with the cart, yeah. There is a cart over there, but I tried interacting with it and nothing happened. There's a cart over there at the bottom. I don't... Can I push it, maybe, from the other side? Oh, sure can. Come on. Come on, little mill man. Can I not push it any further? Did I break it again, do you think? I feel like it has to be in the in the middle. <laughs> Guys, I keep breaking things. I think it's stuck. I can't see on what it's caught though. I think the game is like there's there's been a there's been a bunch of bugs in this game so far. I'm pretty sure that was just another one. We've had, um, we've had a bunch of bugs so far, which is kind of unfortunate, considering this game is not super long and not particularly cheap either. Wait, what? Wait, now all of a sudden it's, it's already rolled out. I think I just have to roll, like, I'm pretty sure I just have to roll out the cart, like, to this point, and then use it as, like, a... a stepping stone, you know? I don't think I can, um... I don't think I can jump it. I mean, I can try. Oh my god. I literally pressed the exact same button, but okay. The wood on the ground was a little bit wobbly. The the, pro, the 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 frustrating part about these kind of things though is that I don't know if it's a bug or if it's intended, you know. I can't push it back. Oh, see, no, it's fine. That is exactly what I was supposed to do. Okay. It was just caught on something. I don't know. All right. I thought the game- No, what? Bro, what the fuck was that, mate? My phase win. Yeah, it is a shame that there's a bunch of bugs, but it's okay. Where did Timmy go? Timmy got eaten by Slenderman. Maybe, maybe, maybe she's fine, though. There we go. Yeah, I pulled it a little bit towards us. Which makes a difference, it seems. 
Can we go zip lining? This is fine. People seem to really like television in this place. Okay. They're all being brainwashed by television. I think exactly that's what's going on, Kiago. You know what I found out recently, guys? So, I pay every month for cable television, right? Turns out, like, a third of the broadcasting is ads. It's like as if you're subscribed to my stream here on Twitch and you would still see ads. And for some reason, that's normal? What the? I should cancel my sub, dude. crazy well I pay for cable because it's like it's like a few euro a month because it's like, basically they make you pay for internet connection right for example I can get a landline telephone as well which I really don't need for like one euro a month it's like it's like pretty much free but you know so I, I don't know exactly how much I pay for my internet a month I think it's like 63 euro or something and then including cable television it's like 65 euro there's a couple shows that we like to watch, but we only ever watch those like by recording them and I'm watching them back, you know, so we can fast forward. But... No, you can't opt out, I think, but... Where am I going, guys? Can I walk out of this window? Is it... Oh, no, I cannot. Oh, I have to teleport through her uh, screen. Can I, like, move her, I think? Yeah, I gotta bait her, I think. If I, like, turn it off and then make her look around... I mean, I can't really move, though. I can only control the television when the little red light goes on on the TV, it seems. So, I, can only, like, I can't control the TV over here. This is as far as I can go. Yeah, so this one I can turn on over there. Do you think if I turn on the T or turn off the TV over here and then run in this direction, she will go watch the other one? <laughs> she really loves her show. It's a good show, guys. I like how the TV is just hanging from a string outside her, outside her window. Nah, there's a couple good television shows in the Netherlands that I like to watch, but... I don't see most of those I can watch on YouTube as well, or like, anywhere else. Guys, by the way, I'm getting really into uh, Death Note now. I think I've seen about, I would say like 16, 17-ish episodes. I've seen a bunch. 
There's like a lot of plot twists all the time, man. It's much better than I thought it was going to be. Yeah. See, the thing is, there's probably a lot of like, um, what do you call this? Like a lot of standard things that happen in most anime. But I have never really watched any animes, right? So I have like no baseline. So like, the only thing I know is that every single time anything happened, they're like, <gasps> NANI! Like that's the, that's the only thing that's kind of starting to bother me already. It's like a cliche, you know? Every time, every time something happens, you have like the little eye flicker and like, <gasps> NANI! Like every fucking time. It's like, bro, stop it. You don't have to be that surprised, okay? But um, yeah, most of those, most of those cliches I don't really know. So, you know. Yeah, it gets a bit cringy. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It gets a bit cringy. No, I'm good, man. Every single time I bring up anime on, on my Instagram story, I get about a half dozen recommendations of different shows. It's okay. Yeah, see, here we go again. Mama just killed a man. Turn his television off. Switch the button, now he's dead. Oof. Oh, 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 hello, 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 hello. Jeez. That was just natural selection? Okay. It's a bathtub, guys. It's a bathtub with a view. This is beautiful. I'm a little jealous. I want to have a bathtub with a view right now as well, but... I certainly will be, Boiler, yes. This is safe. Zip lining. Hey guys, are you watching something on the big screen? Oh no, it's the Isle of Freaking Sauron over there, bro. Don't do it, man. Don't look at the eye, guys. Don't look at the eye, okay? It's like looking at the eye of a horse. You do not look at the eye of a horse either, because the void, it will suck you in. Have you ever looked into the eye of a horse? You can't, okay? There's a void there. I've, I've done it before. Next time you see a horse, you might think of this, okay? Don't look into its eye. The void will just consume you. Okay, what are you talking about? Don't look at the eyes of a horse, bro. I'm telling you. Uh, are we gonna throw this one off? Man, they make good string. Like, this city must be known for its string making. They make good strings. This is fine, right? I'm just gonna teleport. Yeah, I don't see the... Yeah, okay. Bring rope. Oh god, okay. Same difference, guys. I saw a, a switch. I think the water is now... 
Let's test it, guys. See if it's safe. It's fine. All good. Can I use the bucket? Um, I think we have to pull these planks, run to the switch, and then electrocute whatever's coming out of it. I don't know what's gonna come out, but... Oh, jeez. Smells like bacon. Yo, what's up, Ace? We have uh, gone from just hanging out and trying to run away from things to just straight up murdering them instead. Loco, I think there's more to this story than you told us. Well, I told you all I know, pretty much. Ooh. At least the TV still works. Yeah, when the drummer bring, brings out like his second kick drum, that's that's one, you know, that's a little too much for me, man. When he's just sitting there like, you know, that's just... <sighs> okay, so there's a hole there. At, at, okay, right. Alright, I didn't know that. I was just... Curious. I should not be touching this, should I? There's a shoe. Okay, well, I guess we go through... Uh, let me turn on the... I have... Mass. Do we know who blocked... No, we don't know anything, bro. Like, everything's... Everything's odd. You joined the stream and Loco dies immediately? What do you mean? There's a zero death run. Timmy got eaten by Slenderman, guys. I don't know where he's at. Also, we found out Timmy is a girl and actually is called, sh like, six. Um... <clears throat> My character's name is Mono. Oh, we're going... Oh, okay. So what's the point, though? I mean, I can go through it, sure. But I don't have to be there. I can't get out of this, though, can I? So, I... Okay, I can teleport here. Hmm. Okay, let's go back down, I guess. I can do that, okay. I wasn't sure if I could. Previously, we, like, fell halfway through. Uh, I do stream six days a week, yeah, yeah. Isn't that exhausting? Um... No, it's fine. Maybe when I'm a boomer, though, it's going to be harder to do. What's going on, Arconia? I was thinking maybe I can, like... 
I have to fix. Hmm. Do I not have to fix the wiring upstairs? I think luck was overthinking. I'm very good at overthinking. Oh, you know what we can do? We can probably get on top of the elevator again, like we did earlier. We can pull the, 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 the thing, and then we go through the television, and then we jump on top of the elevator. I just don't know when to jump. Right now. Dude, I am a god at this game. My timing was impeccable. All right, now I'm up here. Um, yeah, that's great, guys. Now we're up here. <laughs> yeah, all right, great. Okay, yeah, sure. We might want to do that on the way down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like the floor in, in between. Come on, get on the TV. No, bro, bro. Hey, stop it. If I had a portal gun, I'd be using it as well. Speed run. Can we play with the car for a little bit? We'll yeet the car down the elevator shaft. That was fun. What about the bunny? Get the bunny, grab it out. Or, or grab it, get rid of it. Nice. Once again, a duck. What is it with ducks, man? Like, there's like a guy that like... Designed ducks for four mornings straight. He just made ducks. All he did was make ducks. There's like dozens of ducks in his game. Lots of different kinds of ducks. He just designed ducks the whole time. What's going on, infested Zergy Zerk? Looks more like what? A porygon? What is a porygon? Sounds like I'm saying a bad word. Oh god, that's creepy. It's a Pokemon? That's a fake Pokemon, guys. Everyone knows that. If it's not the original 150 or whatever, it's... It's fake. Can I just yeet things down the elevator shaft? Is that what we're supposed to do? Because that's my first instinct. Wait, it is one of the original ones? Oh my god. I'm gonna have to hand in my nerd card pretty soon, guys. Wait, what does Porygon look like? Hold up, I need to look it up. Oh, is that the really ugly, like, robotic looking thing with like, it was like grayish and it had like blue and red? Oh no, it's just blue and red. Oh, it's still ugly though. No, this is Porygon 2. Where's Porygon 1? Is this Porygon 1? Yeah, I only, I only remember cool ones, guys. What is this? That is kind of like a duck, I agree. Luckily, it's not ugly, it's special. Psyduck is a duck. Psyduck is cool, though. I like Psyduck. It's a low polygon count uh, Pokemon. So wait, what am I supposed to do here, guys? I've, I've yeeted a bunch of things down the elevator shaft. Is there anything else I can do? There is something in the wall here, yeah. Do you think I can go through that? No. Oh, dude, the box is hiding a vent. It's like a Tom and Jerry mouse hole over here. 
I've never seen an event like that in real life, but they seem to be very common in video games. Grandma! The bathtub flooded. You dropped the soap. Uh, I gotta turn off. Oh, this is not, oh, not fine, not, not fine. I thought I had to go for my parkour, but not parkouring, guys. Can I, um, can I turn the TV off by any chance? Can't. Bro! Oh, my character is really bad at parkour. I can make that jump. Well, there is, I guess it's, oh, actually, yeah, it's probably fine. Ooh. Ooh, okay, all right, all right. we'll just jump to the, to the dry spot. I'm pretty sure we got an electric with grandma, uh, grandma though, guys, so. Aha, classic case of overthinking. Grandma's really into her program. All she does these days is smoke cigarettes, take baths, and watch television. It's a hardcore version of The Floor is Lava. Well, The Floor is Lava is pretty hardcore too, man, when you think about it. What a life. Uh... Why is... I'm pretty sure I have to kill Grandma, but I don't know why, though. Double kill! Including myself. That was... I don't know if that counts as a double kill. I guess it's a double kill by the electrocution thing, I'm a jig. That's... Can I... I'm assuming I need her TV. I, oh no, I need the stool. I think I need the stool that she's standing... Like, close to. Where do you think I can jump to, though? Do you think I have to jump on the soap? I think I'm gonna try and do that. Oh! I don't know, bro. I'm not sure. I think I might be able to, but I'm really not sure. Grandma dropped the soap. Shouldn't have done that. Guys, I don't know. I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure I'm not able to just grab the little stool. I'm pretty sure we have to move grandma first, but just in the off chance that I might potentially be overthinking something. This is my favorite, like, telephone or television program too. Yeah, see, like, no. See, I'm not overcomplicating things for once. I feel like I do have to do something with the soap, man. I can I jump back to the toilet? Oh, I can. Grandma! Your time has come! That was technically not murder, guys. 
I mean, it was already... The floor already was lava when I got there, okay? And she just walked into it. She ran into it herself, officer. I swear. I had nothing to do with it. Technically an accident. Man, Grandma was not invited? Look at these. They're all having a blast. I, <laughs> I electrocuted Grandma in self-defense, officer. I can't prove it, though. Yeah, this is where the cool kids hang out. Grandma was not one of the cool kids. I can't do anything. I can't. They're just for aesthetics, guys. <sighs> no, nothing's creepy here at all, Val or Valgor. No, no, no. 